The other surgical option to treat the breast cancer when, when diagnosed is a complete removal of the breast, which is known as a mastectomy. Mastectomies today are now done through relatively small incisions, and we do what's called a skin sparing technique in almost all cases, where we'll preserve all of the natural breast skin, and sometimes even the nipple, and then allow plastic surgery to do a reconstruction. That allows a woman to have a reconstructed breast, but have all of her natural skin and possibly her nipple left, cosmetically not leaving any visible scars, so that in normal clothing, no one will know that a patient has had surgery. The advantage of mastectomy is that you don't need to have radiation afterwards and you won't have to have uh, imaging uh, or screening because the breast is gone. The disadvantage is it's a much larger operation and it does require additional surgery with plastics for reconstruction. Reconstruction is done in one of two ways. We can do what we call implant reconstruction and that's where we take an artificial implant and place it under the skin where the breast used to be to recreate the breast mound or we can do what's called an autologous or flat-based reconstruction where we take tissue usually from the abdomen or the stomach and we take the excess fat and skin and we bring that up and we create a breast mound out of that. Both of those are things that, that are options for patients and those are discussed with a plastic surgeon. In general, we try to do the mastectomy and the reconstruction at the same time so the patients have the majority of the work done under one anesthetic.